Okay, let's go ahead and uh, get started with our PLC work today. Last time we created a, a program and uh, we put it over on the PLC, we saw that we could light up a light by using a non uh, a normal open switch. Let's go to the uh, shared screen. And I believe this is your, I believe this is your uh, program. We had an input one, which we went to the address bar and the address picker, and we picked input one, and we said input one was X0001. We said that our first LED, I named it first LED because that's my first LED, uh, was Y0001. X's are always inputs, Y's are always outputs. Then we know that all uh, programming uh, on uh, ladder logic has to end with an end statement. And so we made an end statement, we took it to the PLC, we sent it to the PLC and we saw that it worked. So now you're, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna use the same switch, switch number one, but we're gonna turn on two LEDs instead of just one. So we're going to start by Bringing, uh, finding an area, uh, not A, but you can use B, C, D, any of these, and just make a box. So that's what you've done. You're in that box now. You're going to press Control, arrow down, and you see we have an arrow down. We can either go to the left or the right. In this case, we want to go to the right. If we were going to be making a loop, we would go to the left but we'll talk about that at a different time. Right now, we're just gonna to go to the right. We would use an arrow to the right, and there you've created it. Now we're gonna come up here to the output. Hang on, I gotta get an instruction. And we're gonna to go to the output, and we're gonna click it twice. Now it says, what output do you wanna send it to? Now I can push this little box and go to my uh, address picker, and pick it from there. But I know that it's going to be Y002. Y002. And we're going to say that's okay. And now we have two lights. We can light two different LEDs with the same switch. So if you were in a, an organization and they were making some widget, and the widget was being made and everything was fine. But one day the boss came and said, but I need you to operate these two motors at the same time. You'd go, oh, okay, I can do that. I can just put them in, in uh, where it operates from one switch, but it operates two LEDs, as long as you don't go over the amperage rating of your, of your switch, okay? So I think at this point now, what we need to do is, you need to go ahead and put, develop your program with a, a second LED and uh, we'll go from there. So let me stop sharing. We'll come back here. So that's what we're gonna do. Now, this is the first part. We're gonna have a second part. The second part is where we're gonna send it to the PLC and see if it works. So you need to go ahead and adjust your program so that you have two lights going, and your assignment's actually gonna to be to have four lights going for one switch, Y1, Y2, Y3, and Y4. That will be your assignment. But for right now, we're just gonna prove that one and two can operate from one switch. So that's all I got. Uh, so until next time, the best of luck, and we'll see you uh, in the next video.